So in this video, I'm going to show you my predictions for, for the winners of Mr. Olympia. In top 8, we have Alexandro Cabrera. He has such a wide shoulders, small waist, and he has an incredible classic physique, packed V form. And I think this guy is that he has a 212 pounds, and he this year he's going to have an extra 7 pounds of muscle, which is going to come back even bigger. He, he has a fantastic posing very shredded, wide shoulders, and I think he's going to surpass the competition and be in the top 8. So for sure. In top 7, we will have Mike Summerfield. This is a German guy. He has an amazing condition, a fantastic classic physique, wide shoulders, small waist, fantastic legs, like incredibly massive, and I think he, he will make it to go even more shredded than the last year with a, an extra, no, 6 pounds of muscle and uh, he's going to um, be in top 7. So in top 6 we have Brian Ansley, he uh, be in top 6 and uh, Brian was in 4th place in Mr. Olympia. He has won a lot of Mr. Olympias, I'm not sure how many, but he's older, he has 44 years, but I think he will go, he's going to keep his condition. He also has a fantastic physique. Um, 168 centimeters, and so it have the same amount of muscle than the other than the other competitors. He has an excellent physique. His posing are supreme, and I think um, play his body very well, which is going to make him to go to the top six for sure. In top four, we have Tyrion Ruffin. This has the best posing on the competition. He can display and show his body better than the other competitors, which is a very good advantage. The fantastic physique, wide shoulders, small visage is that he is 5 feet 5, which is bad because he cannot have the same amount of muscle than the other competitors. However, I think that with the extra pounds, he's going to be surpass the competition and be in top 4 with all that muscle. So in top 3, don't hate me guys, we have Ramon Dino. Ramon has a lot of muscle, he's, he has a fantastic classic physique, but I think that he is limited by his poses. I think that he cannot display his physique to the best of his abilities, and a very big disadvantage for him. Here I believe that he's, go he's going to get even closer to a Chris Bumstead, and um, no pounds, I think he will be even bigger, be a monster, and I think he's going to get close to Chris Bumstead. And in the next years, maybe he's going to the next Mr. Olympia. So, guys, in top two, we have Evers. Uh, I hear he was well under the weight class, and he, and he wasn't able to compete at his best because he had suffered some food poisoning. But this year, he is going to come back bigger more shredded and uh, he'll be the top two. I have that feeling. He has such a small waist, white shoulders, a fantastic physique, excellent condition. So in top one we have Chris Bumstead, um, four-time Mr. Olympia champion. He, he is six foot one with, and that he can, he can have more muscle. He is good looking, white shoulders, small waist, be the top one and he's going to come back bigger with more muscle and with the, and with his posing he's going to be the best for sure this video drop a like and subscribe guys and uh, let's see if my predictions are right so see you next video guys thank you very much